way back in the year, I believe it was nine, no, it was 2017. Yep, right? 2017. It was, was long ago. it was way long ago. Somebody in the comments suggested that we put some sodium in our tank or we cut some sodium with the water jet. Is that what you brought us? Yeah, I got you a big old chunk of sodium. Probably wouldn't want to cut something this big, so let's. Let's trim it down with my uh, massive knife here. If I were to just grab this from you and throw it into that tank, like... I would run. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, That's good sodium, to know. Just... A piece like this would be like a stick of dynamite going off. <laughs> uh, we're going to... I like, I like where this is going. <laughs> a small piece so that if it does explode, it's not going to you know, damage anything. And what there. is that that you store it in? That's uh, mineral oil. Mineral oil. Something unreactive. Yeah, as long as it doesn't get confined, <laughs> the water doesn't go over top of it or anything, it should just... Uh, so, your uh, prediction is when we cut through this that it's just gonna... My prediction is it'll go along fine and then it'll melt. <laughs> okay. Well, I'll let you uh, strap it down. Do not drop is it, it in the tank. Is it safe to lick? Uh, I've done it. I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> like, what happened Wait, what's that supposed it? to mean? Now I really want to see him do it. It's a little tangy. <laughs> do it. Yep, it tangs. <laughs> Still tangy. <laughs> kind of like licking a 9-volt battery. Remember, when huh. this reacts with water, it forms caustic yeah, soda. And it dissolves uh, fat to make soap. So, like, the cell walls of your uh, flesh turns into soap. So, like, there's a hole being born and burrowed yeah, into my tongue that, right that now? That little bit there, it's, it'll dilute away. You probably only killed a few cells. It's fine. <laughs> and it still feels a little tingly. <laughs> Are we standing close enough? Probably too close. <laughs> if you're standing behind the expert, you're good. Okay, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. we ready? Okay. Whoa! Yeah, that was dope. Yeah, nice. You weren't kidding. <laughs> Holy cow. If you confine it, then the hydrogen has nowhere to go, and it actually generates oh, yeah. an electrical uh, Coulomb explosion that causes the whole thing to react all at once. It's actually the same strength as TNT for the same amount of mass. You just about killed us. He <laughs> should have told me that before. <laughs> this is a lot uh, wider and uh, thicker than the other one. And I think uh, you guys are going to try to cut it uh, about like that. So it's a little bit longer. Would you so, recommend this? Uh, I. I still don't think this will explode. I don't want it to explode while you're cutting it. <laughs> Actually, having it underneath that metal kind of makes me nervous because that's confining it. That could confine it. it. Yeah, so just kind of we'll hold just it barely out. pinch it and then cut it further out there. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Okay. Did you capture me screaming like a girl? Yeah, I got it. Don't yeah. worry. <laughs> so that was uh, all done with uh, like just ounces of sodium. Yeah, I didn't want to do too much because I didn't want to damage your machine. And uh, how much sodium do you have left? I've got about four more pounds of it. Fun first, safety second. That's how you That's, can remember. Usually I'm the unsafe guy. You didn't do enough that it would have really hurt us. It might have blinded us because uh, a lot of you guys weren't wearing safety glasses. But Mitchell had a yeah. safety squint on, I saw that. <laughs> <laughs> but we're doing this uh, at our own risk. I don't recommend uh, doing anything. Don't, don't try to copy us. We know better, but we're just too stupid. And that's why you need to go to Cody's channel, because <laughs> let him risk his life instead of you. Oh.